Hi, it's Nicole, and today I have a set of three baby cards using the Hello Baby stamp set from Lawn Fawn. And I have colored all of these cute little critters with the Spectrum Noir colored pencils. And I'm going to be sharing just the coloring portion of these cards since that is pretty time consuming in itself. But I wanted to talk a little bit about the Spectrum Noir colored pencils today. I recently got these and they are professional colored pencils that are perfect for shading and creating those 3D effect for colored stamped images that really pop and shine. And they are really nice. I love them. I've used the Prismacolor colored pencils for years and they're very um, com they're very similar, I would say. The One of the things I like best about these Spectrum Noir colored pencils is that they come in these five sets of 24 colors each, and they come already pre-coordinated. There's about three colors per, uh, three shades per color, I guess is what I want to say, and they all the guesswork's done for you. You, They blend together nicely. That's not to say that you can't go pick other colors and shades from other sets because I definitely do that as well. But the colors that are in the sets are generally, you know, made to, there's three colors per shade that are made to work well together. And I've used colors from all of the sets here today. I'm simply stamping my images on some smooth white cardstock using a black dye ink. And I'm just stamping several of them. I'm not going to be coloring like all of the little ducklings there. I'll just do one of them for the video purposes. But I, although I have sped up the video a little bit, I am not going to speed through it too much. I am going to insert some music here so you can just watch me color in a little bit and don't have to listen to me <laughs> go on and on and because there's not a lot to talk about once I get to coloring. However, I am going to lay down my color. It lays down beautifully and it, and it blends really nicely. I am going to be using the Gamsol and some stump pencils to be blending the Gamsol and the colors of the colored pencils for that really professional, smooth, blended finish that really looks nice on cards. So I'm starting with my lightest colors, kind of similar to Copic coloring, I would say. And then I will blend or add my darker colors. And when I blend with the Gamsol, again, I will start with my lightest and go to the darkest. So I'm going to insert some music here. And then I will simply be coloring. And I will come back near the end of the video.
now that I have all of my cute little critters colored, I'm going to go back in with the Sakura Black Gel Pen and just add some detail to those eyes. I think it helps make the eyes pop a little bit, especially after you've colored over them with pencils. Sometimes I think it makes the eyes a little dull, so that just makes those little eyes pop. Plus, it's hard to tell in the video, but in person it is slightly raised, so it just gives them a nice dimensional look. And then I love adding the white detailing to my critters, and I'm using the Sakura White gel opaque pen here to add detail to the bunnies and the frog and the little duckling as well. One last thing that I did not share in the video but I like to do for the little bunnies is take liquid applique or the Marvy snow pen and add it to the bunny tails and when you heat set it it puffs up and gives a really cute dimensional bunny fluffy tail that I think is just a really nice finishing touch for those little those little critters. Now I do want to, these pins do dry very quickly however you do want to make sure they're nice and dry before you add your the coordinating die cuts and run them through your die cut machine otherwise they could smear a little bit. I have done that before but they do dry really quickly. I would just give them a second before you run them through. I hope you've enjoyed this video showing the Spectrum Noir colored pencils and how they can be used to color these sweet little critters from the Hello Baby Lawn Fawn stamp set. For more projects featuring the summer 2014 Lawn Fawn release, please check out my blog at www.nicolemcgwork.typepad.com. As always, the supplies I've used are linked below the video here on YouTube. Please subscribe for more videos shared every week. Thanks for watching.